You can sit down in front of your house and smoke weed. You know what I'm saying? And not get in trouble. Like, or like by the time they're there, you can throw it down. But what weed? What weed? <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? So, with niggas, with niggas being, with that, I'm like, bro, we smoking's legal. Niggas also, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> niggas also, I'm sorry. But niggas also shit to wear. Like, niggas go bang. Niggas not gonna shoot it out. Niggas would be like, come on, let's meet up by the baseball park. Hey, son, I know I miss that shit so bad, son. Like, niggas is just like ready to see who had the most hands back then. Nigga. And like, it's not, not even on no, like, just one of the fights or something. Like, yeah. people, people don't understand and people forget unless you, like, did that shit. Right. Like, how important that was to build your fucking character. It really wasn't. Like you kept up with like your numbers and shit like that, some you were like, okay, I need to watch this side. I need to I can't talk learn, shit in these places. Learn, right. You know what I'm like? Yeah. I, I miss it. Do. I miss it so much and like and like this is why I wanted to make sure I was on this shit like with the smoking podcast. Like I'm in the psychology, heavy as a motherfucker. Like I talk I I quietly talk about shit because self-taught isn't respected as it should and as you know, as a lot of people do. So I've been like reading the books, talking to different people who like been in the field, like just being aware and just watching shit, son. I'm like that that fighting shit, son. That that actually throwing hands with another male that you have a, with an issue with, son. If you really think about it, if you were blessed enough to have that throw it on to where you was hoping he was tired enough to where he couldn't no, throw another punch, and you were like you tried to pretend that you wasn't tired, but you were about to fucking pass right, like you was right. hoping. Right. That got your mind right. And you were like, okay, well, this motherfucker is built like like I'm gonna keep it a buck. That's how right. I. That's the way I respected women, son, and small niggas. There was a chick who I keep a damn with my ass. She was a golden glove boxer, had no clue. Yeah. Like me, I'm younger, cause I'm like you know, 12, 13, So some people just got it in them, bro. You know the crazy thing? I, I feel like we all, I feel like we all got it in some, but society makes certain people so. It ain't gonna so sort of frowned upon, and, like, and, and, like they don't make like shoot the nigga like that. He ran up on me, shot, like you know, the self defense. They make that seem more. Logical than like, it's oh, he true. ran up on me yeah. and I banged with that ball. Like, but, you know, but let me let me give you my, my yeah. opinion. I want to say the answer because I don't have the answer. My opinion, or think about it like this: how how many how many people had the self confidence be like, I'm willing to catch hands. Like nowadays, most people don't have the confidence to do that shit. So when you say it, I'm not with the guns. Let me fight you. That's almost more threatening. Like, oh, you know, that's one of the reasons. You really like that, like that nigga. So it like makes you almost a bigger target in this. I don't want to say pussy age, but it's like this softer age. I'm like, son, like I, I'd rather lose to motherfuckers. Yeah, that nigga drop it, but I'm a, I'm just not gonna hit the left no more. Right. I'm gonna catch that nigga. I'm gonna make sure we catch the fade again. The crazy thing. I'm not gonna hit his the, kids. The, I'm not gonna hit his alley up none of his streets. I want that ball. You know the crazy thing is right. that's the reason I. Uh, I'm thankful I grew up in a small town because like everybody know that. everybody on a first name and last name basis or at least a first name, you know? So, so like the crazy thing is like when niggas, it was like sports center, like you knew that shit would be talked about tomorrow. So like you was like, you would want to bang for like everything you got in your soul because you know, because you know. Oh, but you heard about this ball, Chris Paul? No, that shit would get around town. Ball, that ball, that ball, uppercut that ball. Well, I've never nah. seen an uppercut, like you know. But see, check this out. Like people say, you know, what I'm saying one of the things that fucked it up was like social media and shit. And I can kind of half-ass agree, but it's like. My nigga, if you if you, you professional boxers get dropped, professional athletes get dunked on, professional soccer players get crossed up, so what are you as a regular motherfucker? You invincible? So in my mind, like, it's survival I, mode, you know? No, it's not even that. It's just niggas are scared. Like, I feel like oh, that's a definite. That's 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 a definite. Some people just not really built like that. But like, like they just don't, one thing, like, one thing, they, like they I say, I say, Lotel had like a. Lotel had a like Lotel Elementary for sure had like a fucking prison feel to it because you just knew if it happened to you once it's not gonna stop you know so you was like bro like if a nigga play like take it to the bathroom because my grandmother was a lunch lady we had teachers so, that would do that shit my grandmother looked at me with so much pride like that was just yeah like like say especially when you're young like when you when you in high school shit like that you know what I'm saying. Like, and I need to get, I need to need to more familiar with the lives. I be forgetting to do the shots on people, shit like that. That's how I was with said mine, but I'm like, I forget about them and shit. They gonna be feeling lonely, so I'm like, I, I ain't gonna do that to, to my two fucking fans, you know what I'm saying? But shout out to my mom, my sister. Yeah! <laughs> shout out to my mom, my name, my grandma. 
Like, all right, bro. So like, that that's like my coaching staff. Like, because they'll, like, anybody else will be like, oh, I like, I like this, bro. Like, you're going in. Like, yeah, Morgan, too. Like, Morgan will be like, bro, are you tripping? And, like, my grandma did know will be like, like you, uh, like she Irish or something? No, it has got strong accent. Like that shit funny. Uh, like, first language is French. That's just how you enjoy that. Just saying, that shit, that shit funny as a motherfucker, son. But hey, but like, it's sad, son. I'm not even joking. I remember my age, and like I said, I crack jokes on it, but I be 100 percent serious. Like the age of them years between motherfuckers really not. We gonna tear it down and I'm just gonna be, it's, it's gonna be is what it is. Yeah. And motherfucker just throwing the gun. I feel like it happened to like a, a five year quick span. I literally remember getting into a motherfucker like uh, late elementary, early middle school. Yeah. My mama put me in boxes. She was like, if you're gonna be doing a fight and I really want you, we know what the fuck you're doing. Yeah. I took like a year of boxes, son. Done with boxes. I feel like I came home with it. I came back. Next thing you know is, how the nigga looked in my hair. I'm like, nigga, you have pink. People can't look. Oh. I'm like, so I'm like, I just, I, I really wasn't... happened that fast. And I'm like, what happened between motherfucking like? You hey, know, hey, you know the crazy thing. What I think, fuck? my theory, because I, I deal with, the, I deal with every year. I got to deal with a new group of the youth. And before I get into this, shout out to my girlfriend Mari. She's like, right now, she's the only person in my life. But like, she just like doing like. A hooper nigga. Like, you know, like, you're like, my mama gonna be at the game, nigga. Like, you know, like, I know that. Like, I got one person that's gonna be at that game. Shit, Now, yeah. back to what I was saying, <laughs> with the, uh, with the party shit, I would peep out of shit. And I'm gonna study of music because I know the entertainment industry and music go hand in hand. Like, that's the same shit. It's within the same umbrella. It is the same thing. It's both, yeah, entertainment shit. Anything, like, entertainment yeah. is so fucking so, good. So when Chief Keef got popping and he a legend, I'm gonna go on record saying that he changed the game. But Chief Keef was the first person who was like, I'm not in the mansion. I'm in my mama house. I'm in my grandmother's house. And nigga, I got straps. I got fucking texts and all kind of shit. And niggas was you like, doing, niggas seen that. Like niggas was like, oh, you ain't gotta be a mansion to do that shit. Like, 2020, openly? A nigga, I'm about to fucking be in the all mill fucking. You can get a with a fucking Glock in my video, nigga. Like, thuggy. And it grew my dreads to where niggas don't see my face. Like, niggas did what Chief Keep did. And I can only speak for Louisiana. Like, bro, it seemed like, to me, after that, in my area, after Chief Keep and them, like, he got it started, came Music Mafia, was like, yo, we came through and niggas was like, cut my dreads into BR cut and fucking <laughs> Cut my dreads into BR cut and fucking thug in the club, nigga. I will shoot this bitch up. You playing? Get off with me. And like, like, bro, like, I was like, yo, this shit's crazy. Cause I'm like, this shit's detrimental to what I do. So, son, for a minute, dog. I look when I was young, before I was into business, I'm sitting like, I would not in my life want to fucking own a club. Because look, I was in Gonzalez for a minute. They opened up a club. You know what I'm saying, dude? Put money into it, nice club, you know what I'm saying? It wasn't like, you know, no, oh, you can't be hardcore, come here, you can't get the come here, you know, you abide by the dress code, we have a certain nights for blah, blah, blah. The club was open, son, for like two weeks. Somebody got thrown through the glass and the whole club got shut down, son. Mm -hmm. I'm like, how in the fuck is that? Like, why did cause this motherfucker get thrown through it? You... Uh, man, I couldn't do it. So you know, you know, I was thankful for like, like, like with events, like how you doing events, like, I wouldn't even like. If you, know, I, like you know, I was thankful for with, with that shit. Like for some reason, like that cool shit, like even transitioned into like the 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 gangster rap and shit. Like niggas was like, I'm wearing below, nigga. And when you, it, no matter what, like if you wearing some shit that you feel like you gonna be like, nigga, I am not fucking this up. Like you know, I want to at least get security that will bang with niggas. Yeah. Like I will fucking chill. Like you know, I gotta fucking let this fit get soft. You know, like you know. You you, 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 so like, you ride on um, some shit, son, because if you got 800 on the fucking outfit, son, you really not trying to fuck it on the stupid shit. Like, a nigga really got to be disrespectful, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, man. But see, I ain't gonna lie. My thing is, like, I really, you know what I'm saying? I really just do miss, I, I wish there was more hand-to-hand, -hand, you know, combat, son, because, like, I don't just, because, yeah, I keep it a buck. I'm I'm from the South, but I'm not no thug. I ain't no gangster. Mom did a good job keeping all the streets, but all my partners and shit was, so I, I understood this shit. And in my mind, I'm like, well, nigga, I studied, I studied it. I was like, 
I was like, bro, I'm gonna take notes. I so the crazy you. thing is, the shit was no. adjacent. I was, like, I grew up in high school years, like middle school years, West Side, like the outskirts of the West Side. I was lose. Shout out John Vinito, my like my cousin by marriage at the time. Uh, and the thing was just like, I will be, go on record and say between the, 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 doing shit with Morgan and fucking just rolling with Morgan and fucking on weekends, just take this nigga, this nigga helped me jump off the fucking uh, figurative porch. And like, like, cause the nigga would just be like, I'm going on a mission today. And I, I'll be like, yeah, I need you to look out for me. Like, you know, like, let's do like that. Like, crazy shit, like, they, like, Bro, so, so one of the reasons I wasn't in the street, I was just too fat and lazy. Some of my niggas would come knock on the door, you know, let's go here, knock on let's we go here. We lived in a nice, the crazy thing, we lived in a nice spot, but the crazy thing is, like, it was walking distance or, like, a few blocks where you can go and you can see some action. So, bro, if I had the upper fence, I, 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 I love you, be safe, but I can't do no sketchy shit because I don't feel like hopping the fence, fucking my clothes, and mama would be mad. Unless it was sneaking out to, like, fucking get drunk right quick. Like, hey, yeah, it's like, girl I'm, or something, I was like, I'm like, I'm like, bro, bro, I'm like, tell him, wait, 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 tell him where you, tell him, oh, bro, shit, tell shit. him where you live, bro. Like, like bro, like, bro. This, you know, you I, can, live, if, if I live, I live. You get the cab, you know what I'm saying? Say, you want to, you know, promote some, you go to school, then they got the space over there. You know, man. I, I was doing like Adam 22s, you do it like, like, and like, the niggas be like, like, yo, 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 like, niggas be like, yo, hey, off camera. What? <laughs> <laughs> like, speak. <laughs> no, like, tell us, no, like, I don't want you to be organic. If you want to tell a story, why the hell if you want to tell a story off the camera, you know what I'm saying? Let you on. Yeah. Let yeah, I mean, it down, you know? This this is higher knowledge. This is what we just talk about, real shit. Follow I'm, Captain Starsky. This is like my shaman. <laughs> like, my brother, my shaman, my uh, Native American fucking uh, analysis. Uh, just, yeah, bro, like a lot. <laughs> hey, baby, it's somebody you can fucking talk to. Yeah, yeah. And not, like all jokes aside, that I put I put posts up all the time saying this, talk about mentors and people you can fucking talk to. If you too hard to talk to somebody, so don't be around me. Right. If you too hard to talk to somebody, so you too gangster to have somebody, you can resign and don't don't be around me. If you too pretty, you too beautiful to have somebody to talk to, don't be around me. You are the same, like you know. Like, 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 what? You find out the fuck. You have a problem that I, that I ain't have that I don't know about. You, you broke. Welcome to the fucking club. Where I've been there. So the fuck, you, you mad with your mama or something? On, on behalf of, fuck, man. On behalf right. of all my people, bro. It's just people that's on behalf of all my people. You know. I, I'll be able to talk to you, so I'm like, man, you like. On behalf of all my people. Oh, the grease. On behalf of all my people. That's what Phil is. I need you to take a shot of that quality ENJ brandy that needs to fucking call me about a fucking sponsorship. Okay. <laughs> I needs to fucking call me about a sponsorship because I've been doing that, this shit for five that years. E &J Bobby all the homies back at Karen Crow. Like these niggas put me onto this shit. Like niggas was like, bro, ENJ, Koyo. Like niggas would just be like, bro, ENJ, nigga. Like yeah. the shit is cheap and the shit will get you fucked up and it's just quality brandy. This shit get you drunk quick. Shit, shout out Spice I'm Williams, take, nigga. I'm gonna get that for Take a shot, shot bro. I'm take gonna a, get that shot. I'm gonna count you down. I gotta, I gotta get the live to count me down. Count us down. <laughs> Damn, I got that Damn, when Dolph gets up, when Dolph start letting let the beat really rap, Dolph, let, Dolph will let a beat rap and just be like ad lib that shit. Like the beat will go, like, and he be like, oh, yeah, oh. Fuck with it right now. Yeah, let's see, 100, I see one. Shit, I already 100, 100, 100, 200, 300. No, you gotta wait for that, they gotta finish. It's all good, it's the girls, but you know, 